Holy damn, two hours later. Just kidding guys, like 45 minutes to an hour later though. Uh, we just got done at customs and it is finally time to eat. And we're two hours out from Seattle. We're gonna stop there, eat, or I'm gonna eat and then we're gonna go to Seattle. Well, we're going to Seattle, right? <laughs> I'm so tired. Uh, we're going to Seattle right now, and then we're getting. I'm gonna go to the gym, get an upper body pump in, cause my upper body needs some blood in it. I'm getting weird, yo. I gotta stop this vlogging thing right now. All I know is she was buying like a ticket on a dash. <laughs> to experience, yeah, I keep my camera in this, judge me. I haven't bought a case yet and I don't want to get it scratched even though it's already a little bit scratched. But are you guys ready to experience some magic with me? Oh my lord. Mm. Guys, oh! look at that chocolate though. Look at that. Would you look at it? Oh my lord, sweet baby Jesus, we got a melted quest for up in here. We started from the bottom of the whole team. Oh my, oh, you guys, you guys. I'm sorry, this is too much for my channel. We in Seattle. I have a huge pee baby right now. It's my pee baby, say hello. Pee baby. Um, who's excited? I'm excited. I am beyond overtired. Tired, you can probably see it in my face a little bit. We woke up at four in the morning. Um, I went to sleep at around 11.30 last night. Didn't really get the best of sleep and I haven't been for the past few days. My mind has been really busy so I haven't been sleeping as much as I should be. I just wanna like be up all the time doing things. Um, so I haven't gotten much sleep so I'm pretty tired right now but priorities and that means I have to head to the gym. So I do have my alpha mean in high volume, so I am ready to chug that down and head to Gold's Gym. Um, I'm excited because I love Gold's Gym, and I don't know, I'm here in Seattle, guys, and like this is like what life is all about, just experiences and adventures and doing random spontaneous things and just living in the moment. Like I feel like a lot of the times I get so caught up in planning things and just, I get, I stress myself out and I psych myself out looking too far ahead so I'm just here enjoying the moment and I'm happy to be here. I feel super blessed to be here with my best friend um, joining her on this amazing journey and I am super excited to see what the next couple of days and the next few days in LA have in store for us because we're doing things. Here is the rest of our room. We're staying in the Hampton in downtown Seattle. So we're going to Gold's Gym. I'm excited to check it out. I have never been to Gold's Gym in Seattle because I've never been to Seattle before, so. <sighs> new thing. Who doesn't love a new scenery? Who doesn't love a new gym? Let's do this, guys. I don't know if I'm gonna get any clips for you guys because I don't know how busy it's gonna be, but it's a Friday night, so I'm hoping it's not very busy. Well, we did it, but I didn't bring it with me. <laughs> okay, hold on a sec. Hello. Hi, Seattle, you're beautiful. I don't know like what's wrong with me, but it's like every single city here in the States I just want to move to. You guys put a curse on me and I don't, I'm not mad. I mean, the fact that I want to move here just means that I will move here one day. I don't know how, but I will figure it out. If anyone needs a freaking <laughs> wife. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> So kidding. Um, but I didn't bring you guys in with me and I'm glad I didn't because I had to walk to the gym a little bit and it's super ghetto downtown. I don't know like if maybe it was just like the time that I went in or I don't know but I just saw a lot of homeless looking people. Maybe I'm just being judgmental and they're not homeless but they looked pretty out of it. They looked a little bit scary and I'm just glad I didn't bring you guys with me because I would not want to get y'all stolen. <laughs> I had a really good workout. I felt really good. I kind of like for the past few days, um, I haven't really been feeling good about how I look. Um, it's not, I mean like I have, it just comes in waves, kind of like my motivation. <laughs> but um, I haven't been feeling all that good just because you guys know like I got my carbs increased and I've been feeling pretty like soft and bloated lately. Um, I know it's not that I actually like look bad, it's just all in my head and like, like I said I'm so used to looking 
lean, especially because I maintained that kind of look for so long after my surgery. So now, um, with the carb increment, while well, my body gets adjusted to it, uh, it's been looking a little bit bloated. But tonight, I actually felt a lot leaner. I felt like, ooh. <laughs> I felt like my bloatness, or bloatedness, I don't know, it's coming down, so, but yeah, and I got some cardio in as well. I burned 115 calories in 20 minutes, so that goes towards my total calorie burn goal for the week, so that's good. Um, I think I only have around 200 calories left to burn for this week, and yeah, I don't know, I just wanted to update you guys on what's going on tonight. Uh, we're headed back to the hotel right now. I have quite a bit of food to eat. Um, and I don't know, I just enjoy this moment right now. The present moment. I think it's like the endorphins talking, guys. I'm the sweaty mess, you. I've been sweating so long. Feels good. Yes! Right, guys, so we are currently back at the hotel. Um, we went to Metropolitan Market. Literally, I, I don't know if it's just me. Someone please let me know if I'm alone or if I'm not but do you guys feel like overwhelmed where you just like at a beautiful grocery store with like all the type of foods that you guys don't have back home because <laughs> like I felt so overwhelmed in that grocery store like I just wanted to grab everything and I only grabbed um two Chobani Greek yogurts because I have chicken and protein powder to eat tonight so I might have this instead of the chicken and I have some Justin's peanut butter, which I have never tried before. Um, got some Urdu sugar ketchup because I didn't bring any ketchup and I've been suffering. And that's all I got, guys. Literally, I think I felt so overwhelmed because I knew that I didn't want to buy everything there and that I shouldn't buy everything there. So I literally just like, I felt like someone was like holding me back and was like, mm mm. You weren't buying anything here because you don't need anything from here. <laughs> so that's a big step for me, guys. <laughs> the fact that I didn't spend a hundred dollars in that grocery store is a huge step for me. Like, um, I am gonna figure out what I'm gonna eat. I have, I don't think I'm gonna have what I prepped because I have um, Lynn and Larry's cookies, Lynn and Larry's. I have Justin's peanut, but Justin's peanut butter. I can't even talk. Um, and I just have a few other things that I'd rather eat rather than the food that I prepped. So. I'm gonna figure that out. I'm gonna check out right now because I am ready to eat and go to sleep. I'll show you guys what I'm gonna eat and this is about it for today. I don't know if it's gonna be one vlog. It depends on how long it is. If it's not, then I'll see you guys tomorrow. If it is, then thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and comment below if you have any comments for me and let me know. Do you feel overwhelmed at grocery stores that you've never been to before? Good night. <laughs>